But some folks do, some don't. I mean, you could say the name of your business, uh, corporate catering, or you know, deliver to you, or on the go. We can talk about that. Uh, but you want to piggyback, certainly, off the items that you're currently doing on your menu. So, in other words, if you are, you know, uh, a sandwich in Italian place, you don't all of a sudden start offering uh, Greek specialties because you want to do this efficiently. So, um, you want to basically take the items that will transport well, that can be done buffet style. If you do, like, sandwiches are a great example that... Instead of doing individual sandwiches on plates that people call in for or order, you do them on for groups. You can put 10 or 12 sandwiches on a platter. Clients will oftentimes just say, well, just give us assorted sandwiches on uh, assorted breads. You know, we always include about 20% vegetarian and, uh, and 12 sandwiches, boom. And of course, there's salads, there's drinks, there's desserts. But the first thing you want to do in an effort to when you're creating a menu is take a look around and see what your competitors are doing. And uh, I'm not saying do not do not steal menus, do not, uh, but get a sense, you know, uh, download or print up or go by and pick up some hard copies of menus and see what they're selling and what the price range is. And um, you can use that for framework uh, in terms of you're going to have to make decisions about policy, things like delivery charges and uh, how much notice you need and what the minimums are and you're going to have to be able to bill people. Um, some of the mindset's different than a restaurant. It's not, I mean, you can take credit cards. I think more and more, say, people are, companies are charging by credit cards, but you have to set up terms. But I'm telling you, that's where the big fish are. Those six-figure a year accounts, as in $100,000 a year or more accounts, I want one statement at the end of the month, and they send you one fat check. And those cash and work. So um, more to come, but um, you, you do need to be be prepared to start uh, uh, creating an invoicing system so that you can bill your your clients. And you should talk about that on the menu. What you know your terms are generally net thirty.